Hey YouTube, another update here on the plants. I'm going to start off with the experiment plants. Um, I topped these two just to see how they would react for the rest of the season. I want to see, you know, what kind of growth it puts out. And this is three days old. A bunch of new little leaves popping in. Before I topped this one, it had all these shoots in on it. And it's got a whole bunch of shoots coming out. I left those be. And then uh, this one topped it it's getting a little bit of new growth there it doesn't really have any shoots we'll see what they do these ones i'm just letting them go this one's got a bunch of flowers every flower so far it they've all dropped like i don't know if that was going to drop or not but it's dropped all its flowers so far and i'm thinking it's because of the nighttime temps i'm not i'm not exactly certain but they're dropping so I head over here. We've had a lot of rain the past week, so um, I had these plants up against the house. I just finally got to move them back out today. Uh, let's let's start on here. Let's start on the reapers here. All right, this is reaper number one. It's getting its little focus. It will focus. Come on. It doesn't want to focus for some reason that close. All right, but yeah, it's getting, you know, they're getting little stalks growing. But basically this one and the next two are about the same as far as, you know, they're putting out just these tiny little flower buds. I'll get to the last two, which are a little further along um, right here, red boot. It's just now getting its flower buds. That this was the most stunted boot of the yellows and the reds. I think, as far as I mean, it's a bigger plant. You know, it has more green than, than some of the other ones, but it's it's not putting flowers out as fast. This one, it's uh, yeah, it's getting a bunch of little flower pods on it. A whole bunch of them in there. It's pretty thick. So, another red boot, tons of, oh yeah, this one this morning, it lost, lost a flower there, there, and this one, I believe. So the flowers fell off, they might push pods out, they might not, but uh, the stem hasn't turned, it turns yellow right there and drops off, that's how I keep track of if they're going to drop or not, but those look solid, we'll see if they pop some pods out of them. And then there's a bee on this one a few minutes ago. I don't know if it's moved on or not. But uh, right back here, that flower fell off. So that might be another pod. And another one here. Yeah, it's a whole bunch of flowers dropping off. And yep, there's the light on it there's a pod right there that's a pod coming out and this one has a pod there and a pod there so the red boots are starting to kick pods out for me the um the butch tees these three here um this butch pushed a flower out which i saw be on today hopefully it the, it gets the job done that one kicks some flowers out or a flower rather and this one has two flowers that look like they're about to open so the butch teas are they're starting to bloom loaded with flower buds though they're loaded down yellow yellow boot here i don't think i have i might have one or two of the yellow boots that actually pushed a pot out so far but it's loaded down with flowers and um, flower the buds so uh, some nice thickness in a couple of these this one's got loads in there you can tell down there it's dropped a bunch of them oh that one just dropped a flower so we'll see and there's a pod right there yellow yellow boot pod 
and I think that might be it for these ones. I'm not really certain if it's got more pods in there. I don't think so. I think I counted this morning. I think I counted eight pods all together. Yeah, there's that little pod there. And back there, give you a shot of that. It's getting some good growth going. Um, yeah. No more pods on that. I mean, we're talking itty bitty pods, so nothing crazy yet. But it's going, it's going that way. Hopefully, we'll start seeing lots of pods real soon. And these four are the habaneros. I mean, this this thing's got a huge spread of a canopy for a small, like a short of a plant that it is. But I mean, it's it's a bush. That's a bush. It's a bush. <laughs> These have so many flowers. So, so many flowers on them. Lots. And this one, that's that first pod that you saw from my last video. Still real small. It hasn't really grown much in a few days. I don't know if it will or if, it, if it's not going to. But, um, and back here, there's the Reaper. Got a bunch of little flower buds on it. Yep, it's getting loaded down. It's getting whole bunch of good branches in there you know and this one it's got some slug damage on it I can't tell you how many slugs I've killed so far so many of them oh this one is uh it's got a strange way of growing when it when it split off it has those two but then it also has this one and I get it just decided to start growing up you know like that so it kind of did a three-way split there kind of sorta I guess so the reapers I mean just look from the last video to this one the reapers have grown much more than any other plant they're getting pretty big so that's it for this time I know right after I made the last video I had a bout with aphids but uh, I've got that handled now I'm fighting slugs I might do that beer trap somebody said just like put little cups of beer around the plants and they'll fall in and die so I might try that out see if it works but slugs on those things are so nasty you get that slime on you and it don't come off but that's it for this week and I'll do one shot back here I don't think I can get them all I'll get them in the rows like this so you can see all of them at once here yep there so i got about eight pods so far hopefully next time it'll be a lot more and a lot bigger all right guys catch you later